today on USOC Adventures TV. What an experience! Oh, wow! We follow USOC and Pursuit Channel trip winner Bernie Overby from Minnesota. He's down! He's down! Wow! Look at that! Bernie is hunting at Big Chino Guide Service in Arizona with J.P. Vicente and his sons for a trophy mule deer. It's the old syndrome with me. I hit them better when they're moving than when they're sitting. Bernie is 71 years old and his dream hunt for a mule deer was about to become a reality. Keep it right here. Welcome to USOC Adventures TV. I'm Dan Leonard. For the fourth season in a row, we have once again partnered with the Pursuit Channel to give away free trips going all across the United States. These free trips go to members of the Pursuit Channel and members of US Outdoorsman Central who also win free daily gear giveaways. We wanna take you, our TV show viewers, and members places you have never been and only dreamed about going to. Folks, this show is about the average Joe, winning a great trip and being filmed in the process. It's simple to enter and you can do this for free. Go to PursuitChannel.com or MyUSOC.com and enter today. On today's show, we feature Pursuit Channel trip winner Bernie Overby from Minnesota. Bernie's headed to Big Chino Guide Service in Arizona, and he's going after a trophy mule deer. Pursuit Channel and USOC trip winner Bernie Overby from Minnesota is on his dream hunt to Big Chino Guide Service in Arizona in hopes of finding a trophy mule deer. And I tell you, any of you hunters that are interested, you should go down the internet and look up U.S. Outdoorsman Central. I drew one of these hunts to Arizona, this mule deer hunt, so it was fantastic. So it's a great organization, and uh, I'd like to thank Dan personally and, and recommend that uh, any of you hunters out there take a look at that U.S. Outdoorsman Central website. Uh, I think you'll enjoy it. Bernie is a 71-year-old Vietnam veteran with a service-connected hearing disability. He has been an active USOC member for over a year. And once he heard that he had won this trip, he was overly excited. But he knew he had to get in shape to climb this aggressive terrain. Big Chino Guide Service are true professionals that specialize in providing top quality hunting experiences for their clients. Their family owned team has over 25 years experience hunting the lands of Arizona. Big Chino specializes in trophy antelope, elk, mule deer, coos deer, and even desert sheep. Today's hunt will have the founder of Big Chino, JP, and his sons, Michael and Junior, all guiding us. Stay tuned, this is gonna get good. USOC Adventures TV is brought to you in part by Cutmaster, master knife and tool makers, a manufacturer of these fine brands. Oswego County, New York. Visit Oswego County, all four seasons of great outdoors. By Clam, sets up in 45 seconds. No assembly required. Night Eyes Lights. The ultimate in predator hunting lights. MTR Custom Leather. Quality craftsmanship and American leather come together to create the perfect holster. Game Sled. This product eliminates the strain on your back. Lock that waterproof phone bag. Turn your smartphone into an underwater camera. AMS Bow Fishing, Interlock Broadheads, 
and Luminox lighted arrow notch. These are the essential tools for bow fishing. Today, we are hunting in the desert of Arizona with Big Chino Guide Service. Our pursuit channel and USOC trip winner is Bernie Overby from Minnesota. What an experience! Oh, wow! Bernie is a 71-year-old Vietnam vet that is an avid deer hunter and a coyote hunter. He is using his new custom-built AR-30 for this hunt. This is Bernie's lifelong dream to harvest a mule deer. When he was younger, he missed his one and only chance at a muley. And this could be one of his last chances at one of these monsters. In Arizona, you have to be drawn for a tag, but it is not that hard to get one. The Arizona Game and Fishing Commission is very cooperative, and they give back to the habitat. They spend thousands of dollars on water supplies, among other things. The wildlife manager on this unit, he's been here since 2006, and he, I think he's put up like 17 drinkers in this unit. Um, since he's been here, the population of, of the deer numbers in this unit is, is coming back, and uh, so we want to give him a, a big thanks because he's done a lot of work. Ben Borshu. This will be a spot and stalk hunt in the Arizona desert terrain. We are about 30 miles from any road, hunting over 50,000 acres that Big Chino Guide Service provides for their clients. The night before, it rained pretty hard, and it's very unusual this time of year in Arizona. So the object is to climb to the top of a hill in glass. With us is Big Chino owner JP with his sons, Junior and Michael. We also have other various guides, even their sons, in the area glassing with us. What I think is going on is that it rained so hard last night and this morning that those deer are just held up and tightening those straws under those trees still laying down because it's cold. So what we need is this rain to lift. Maybe we'll get a break of sunshine as soon as that sun comes out. Those deer are wet. They're going to want to get in the sun and sun themselves. So we're looking for a couple of bucks we saw yesterday morning. Um, it just stopped raining about 30 minutes ago, so we're hoping that they're going to get up soon and start moving around. It's kind of a slow morning so far. I've just seen a few does. We're trying to locate these bucks right now. Like my brother said, uh, just quit raining about 30 minutes ago. So uh, we're just trying to locate them. They're pretty hunkered down right now, but they're starting to move a little bit. So we'll see if we can get eyes on them. So my guess is here in the next hour or two, we just got to wait it out. And as soon as this breaks, and if we can get some sunshine, get them warmed up, they'll start moving and feeding again. After a couple hours of glassing, the muleys finally started moving out of their bedding areas. Next, it was a stealthy stalk down the hill to get in range. The mule deer we wanted was in a bush, all covered up, so it was very difficult to spot. The muley exposed himself just enough for Bernie to take aim. His chance at a trophy mule deer is now. The first shot missed. Now, the muley was in the open and on the run. But the second shot hit its mark. He's, got it. He's down. Got He's down. Got wow, look at that. What a awesome job. Shot, <laughs> awesome shot. I tell you got what, him. this big Chino guide service in Arizona is fantastic. <laughs> well, thank you. I appreciate wow. it. That was awesome. You made a great shot. It was a great hunt. This mule deer has eluded him for over 40 years. His coyote hunting skills have trained him 
to shoot animals on the run, and this is exactly what happened. It's the old syndrome with me. I hit them better when they're moving than when they're sitting. Now he can cross it off his bucket list. Bernie Overby, our Pursuit Channel trip winner and a Vietnam War veteran, just harvested a beautiful mule deer. Remember folks, you too can be in Bernie's boots. Simply go to PursuitChannel.com or MyUSOC.com and sign up to win these trips. It's free to enter. Pursuit Channel and USOC trip winner, Bernie Overby, just harvested a trophy yeah, really and the up. celebration was on. His first shot was 220 yards and his second shot was about 250. I didn't have time to range it, but I figured he went up about 30 or 40 yards for that second shot. So he must have hit him right in the shoulder because it dropped him right in his tracks. Now was this far in front of his front shoulder? Looks like he's tall, heavy, you know, just a real pretty deer. That's the way I am. I shoot them better when they're moving. <laughs> Let's go see what kind of a dandy we got. This is fantastic. Wow, look at this, guys. Look at this. A real beauty. Fantastic. That is really going to look good on my wall next to my whitetails. <laughs> look at that, Bob. Thank you again very You're much, welcome. Buddy. You're welcome. Yeah. Very welcome. This is a really nice deer. Really it's real nice pretty. deer. It's real pretty Brown. deer from that side. Just a classic desert looking mule deer right there. Look at that. Thank you, boy. You, you, you guys know what you're you got, doing. You got it done. Yeah. Thank you. You guys really are good spotters, man. This is beautiful, beautiful country. Big, beautiful country. My dad started this company back in 87, 88, wasn't yeah. it? Late 80s, right yeah. when I was about the time I was born. So, nice. Um, nice. You know, we're just family owned, and uh, most of our guides are family members. We're all firemen. And, uh, you know, we just, we just love hunting. We love being out here. You know, it's not about the numbers to us. It's just we just love doing what we're doing out here. You know, it's... Good. I, you know, we spend a lot of time out here. We enjoy doing things like this for you, Bernie. You know, it's just, this is a great opportunity for you and for us to be a part of it. It was an honor. And, you know, just want to thank you for coming out here with us. It was, it was awesome. Oh, so, wonderful. And yeah. thank you guys. You're great. Well, the Pursuit Channel and U.S. Outdoorsman Central want to thank you. Thank you guys very thank much. You. I appreciate thank you. it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, buddy. Thank you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> it was time to tag this big muley and celebrate with JP. Big Chino tradition, we always uh, celebrate after we give thanks to the Lord for the opportunity to be out here and hunt and, and kill a great buck. And you know, it's all about the hunt, but we also have a tradition in Big Chino is we toast to the mess and we toast to the kill. So here's to the mess, and here's to the kill. Congratulations, my friend. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. This has been a great, great thing. You know, I saw a nice mule deer about 25 years ago in Colorado. I didn't shoot him, and it's been on my mind ever since, and you've made my dreams come true. Thank you, sir. Oh, you're absolutely welcome, and a lot of hard work on your, end, on your end, and we're here for veterans. I'm a veteran myself from the X 101st Airborne Division, U.S. Army, and um, whatever we can do for veterans, you can assure you we'll always be the firm because they're for us. It wouldn't be for what veterans do. We wouldn't have these great opportunities here in this country to, to have the freedom to bear our arms and to hunt and to enjoy the things we enjoy. So we're grateful. And thank and, you for, for your service. And I thank you for your service. Uh, I was in Vietnam in 68 and I uh, got back here and we got the hunt and that's fantastic. To book a hunt of a lifetime at Big Chino Guide Service, go to www.bigchinoguideservice.com. It's a first class operation and gets one of my highest recommendations. Although Bernie tagged out on his first day at Big Chino Guide Service, his adventure wasn't over. The celebration continued that night at the Oracle Inn Steakhouse. It was Halloween night and good times had by all. It was a great night of dancing and food put on by the Oracle Inn and Steakhouse. 
The next day, our trip winner, 71-year-old Bernie, was off to go rock climbing with a vehicle? Hmm. I didn't realize how big rock climbing was, but in Arizona, everybody's got a rock climber. They turn normal vehicles into rock climbers. They turn everything into something that can go over big rocks. That's just crazy. Totally unbelievable. But we can see why everybody was turning these vehicles into rock climbers. Bernie was having the time of his life. Fantastic the way this vehicle is set up and the way you guys know how to handle this. Wow. So as we were rock climbing, we get out, we're checking out deer trails. They end up being coos deer trails. I didn't know what a coos deer was. Turns out to be a smaller strain of whitetail. So Bernie took a big muley, went on a rock climbing expedition, and told me the third day, I have to rest. What an experience. Oh, wow. Bernie, it was a few days of high paced excitement. I wasn't sure if you were gonna hang on, but you did. Thank you for a great time, Bernie. What a great trip for Bernie. It's adventures like these that we love to showcase to you, the viewers. U.S. Outdoorsman Central and the Pursuit Channel love to give away free film trips. U.S. Outdoorsman Central also gives away free daily gear to its sportsman members. Products like this Raptor Razor field dressing kit. This Rapto Razor Combo Ultimate Field Dressing Knives are used for hunting, skinning, joiner, harvesting, fishing, boating, gut hook, and even industrial use. The Rapto Razor Kit is this week's bonus gear giveaway. Now pay attention. To win this Rapto Razor Field Dressing Kit, send me, Dan, and my USOC an email. Please enter the keywords Raptor Razor. That's one word, Raptor Razor. A winner will be posted later this week on MyUSOC.com or USOC Adventures TV on Facebook. USOC Adventures TV is brought to you in part by Niagara County, U.S. World-class fishing and world-class fun. True North Outfitters. You'll find trophy black bear, moose, and deer hunting in New Brunswick, Canada. While there, you'll be eating lobster and prime rib. You'll also be going out on a whale watching trip. Adirondack Outdoors Magazine. Subscribe online today. Orion Coolers. Never lose your cool. Raptor Racer. Your big game Skinner Kiss. The Quick Sight Elite, putting your target in our sight quickly and easily every time. Handle Right Tool Company. These needle nose pliers are great for every application, from fishing to mechanic uses. This multi use hook is great for everything, from holding up a fish to carrying the grocery bag. Okeechobee Outfitters and the Sportsman Foundation for Military Families will be hosting a Osceola turkey hunt and hog hunt for combat veteran Gary French from Texas. We caught up with the owners of Okeechobee Outfitters, Danny and Carla Santangelo, down at the Great American Outdoor Show in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. Okeechobee Outfitters is a hunting operation in South Florida. We're two hours below Orlando on Lake Okeechobee. We offer uh, hunting trips of alligators, wild boar, Osceola turkey. Uh, we have a large 2,000 acre game ranch that houses all the North American exotics. Um, on top of everything, we run a foundation, the Sportsman's Foundation for Military Families, which honors all combat veterans today, every era of war. We, um, we take them and their families on hunting trips. Well, I just want to say that we have awesome lodging, home-cooked meals. We love the families to come in together, the wives, the children. We're very family-oriented, and that's what it's about, just bringing the families together. Remember, folks, 
U.S. Outdoorsman Central and the Pursuit Channel love to give away free hunting and fishing trips. We do this to promote excitement in our efforts to promote hunting and fishing. All of the trip winners are going to be filmed and they will air on USOC Adventures TV on the Pursuit Channel. Our trip winner shows has featured whitetail hunts, waterfowl hunts, bass fishing trips, king salmon charters on Lake Ontario, outdad ram hunts to Texas, a coon hunt to Indiana, an elk hunt to Colorado, an Alberta bear hunt, and much more. Anyone can win these trips, and it's free to enter. Go to PursuitChannel.com and sign up for free today. We want to make you our next TV star. U.S. Outdoorsman Central gives away free daily gear to our sportsman members. To be able to win the free daily gear, simply go to MyUSOC.com and sign up today. It's very inexpensive to sign up and you get a great membership kit when you join. It gives back all year long. We'll see you next week, folks, and please get out there and enjoy the great outdoors.